listen, I was looking to, since you're a CNA, we have a, um, I just want to make sure you're aware of it because I have to make a check mark here. For all our CNA, we have a CNA care campaign. Um, how are you, how are you finding it difficult or easy uh, uh, renewing your license? It's difficult. Last year was, I don't mean to cuss, but hell. Hmm. What happened with yours last year? Um, I took a hyperbaric technician class that involved like safety and vitals and oxygen and all this stuff. So I took a hour class and they wouldn't accept my class. So I had okay. my, yeah, expired and I had to go back and do the full 48 hours. So. Okay. There you go. If, uh, wait a minute, your license expired, but you had to do 48? Yeah, because I turned in, you know, I turned everything in on, on time, the class, because I called. Like, oh, yeah, that'll be fine. And they said, no, we we'll, they only accept it for registered nurses, not for CNAs. And I'm like, well, it's an in class. So, so somebody on the phone from the state? Yes. You, or? It, and then when I called again, because, you know, you get the letter saying denied. And I was like, I called and they told me it's okay. They said, no, this is not a CNA approved class. I'm like, well, it's better than CNA. It's an RN approved class. And they were, they were still like, no, you have to go back and go take the measly classes that you're used to take. Did you tell them that you talked to somebody at the state? They said they didn't care. I spoke to both managers of, yeah, it, I was yeah. to them and everything and they didn't care. But even though an, an employee of theirs, they're yeah. dead. So I worked for four weeks. Well, you did not work for four weeks. Yeah. No. Yeah, because I didn't have my license. So how did you go back in? Did they? Did, did you have to take the test again, or somebody said, "Oh, just go ahead and"? Yeah, someone said just redo the full forty-eight hours, um, the online classes, and give us all your CEUs, and then we'll approve it. Is it through fax? Is it through phone or through email? Do you know? Uh, I remember. Ask them. You fax them, but this time, did you get the name of the num the name of the person? Uh, usually, what. What happened is that, uh, you know, when a CD calls at the state, they don't get the name of the person. But the person that gave you the wrong information, did you get that name? That day, I don't think I did. So that's why they were able to kick you off. Like, you know, we don't care, right? Cause you could have named the person. Yeah. But this time, did you get the name of the person? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. All of my notes, because I was so angry, I got both managers' names. I have it all in my booklet. Okay. Well, what? Oh my God. You lost four weeks. Yeah. <laughs> I know. We hear these stories a lot, my dear. That's why we decided to do this campaign. It's frustrating. They they treat us so poor. They pay us nothing. And then they want us to take 10,000 classes to get paid like $19, $20 an hour. It, it makes no sense how they treat um, certified nursing assistants.